viewers welcome back to our usk channel this video is going to be a small explanation about kef brand speakers now let's get into the video firstly we are happy to announce that we are celebrating 60th anniversary this year for kef it has been 60 years of milestone in the global market to make millions of souls happy to know what's inside further then please keep watching we'll give you a brief introduction on how the branding is recognized as kef K E F is derived from the word Kent Engineering and Foundry which was founded by Mr Raymond Cook in 1961 at Kent in England. He decided to implement his own ideas into action. Now let's talk about Honorable Mr Raymond Cook. Mr Raymond Cook was a Royal Navy World War II veteran and also a design engineer at BBC. He worked as an in-technical director and a loudspeaker manufacturer. He was eager to experiment with new materials to create products of superior quality that could produce recordings as same as the original performances. Cook's relationship and close cooperation with BBC continued to develop the Kef company and the results were very good. In the 1970s, Kef was awarded the two Queen's Awards for exporting 50,000 loudspeaker monitors. In addition to making speakers, an important part of the Kef's activity was the supplier of loudspeaker systems, baffles and drivers. Cook decided that there could be a huge potential benefit that could be obtained from selling raw drivers to competitors, thus not resulting in the reduction of the sales in the company's own units. But with his hard work and passion, the company reached the production of 10,000 units per week. Thus, he was made an OBE by Queen Elizabeth II in 1979. Here, OBE is Order of the British Empire, which is the honorary for rewarding the arts and sciences, welfare organizations, and public services. The New York Times has also recognized Kef as the leading audio company in Europe and also well known to American high-end listener for several decades. The world is admiring Kef for its innovative high performances. It is a loudspeaker manufacturing and distributor at global level. Now, let's dive into the technologies which Kef has brought to the market. Driver decoupling, coupled cavity bass loading, conjugate load matching, the Kef universal bass equalizer also known as cube and the uniq technology among all these technologies in the 1980s along with the 12 generations one of the landmark innovations incorporating with the new materials in the uniq technology with its outstanding acoustic clarity among all of these technologies in the 1980s along with the 12 generations one of the landmark innovations incorporating new materials is a uniq technology with its outstanding acoustic clarity with the innovation of this particular technology in 1988 a person sitting in an audio room or in a home theater will experience a sound such that it will seem so natural as a musicians or the actors will be there in front of you the sound is less distorted which means the frequencies at your hearing level will be the same all throughout the room making it more realistic in 1992 kef came under new ownership when the company was purchased by gold peak which is in hong kong and a fresh innovation began adding glory to Kef's impressive reputation. Kef's visionary founder Raymond Cook sadly passed away in 1995. He left the company with the principles that expressed his core values of quality, honesty, dedication and innovation. Now let's talk about the latest awards which Kef has achieved in the year 2020. The speakers category are Kef LS collection that is LSX wireless speakers, LS50 meta bookshelf speakers, LS50 wireless 2 which achieves best buy awards in the respective categories. Of all the respective speakers in the series, the Profex which is a unit of BPL are the national distributors for Kef products since the year 2001. We USK Profex are the regional distributors for Telangana and AP for almost 2 decades. We are proud to inaugurate 
the LS50 Wireless 2 Active Bookshelf Speakers at our studio. The LS50 Wireless Speaker awarded as the best stand mount active speaker with its unique Q and Meta Material technology. The LS50 was created to celebrate 50th anniversary and then in 2016, LS50 Wireless was launched as an active speaker system with a pair of wireless stereo speakers packed with built-in amplification and streaming services such as Spotify, Amazon Music, Internet Radio, Podcast, etc. It has achieved the Product of the Year Awards in 2020. The immersive execution of this concept earned them a 5-star review. It has been designed to squeeze out even more performance and the UniQ driver arrangement through the introduction of a new KEF innovation called Meta Material Absorption Technology, which is also called as MAT. With Meta Material Absorption Technology, every spot is a sweet spot. This technology eliminates unwanted sound, resulting in more lively performances. Meta materials are the specially developed structures that are used in the existing materials to produce new properties, which results in more thrilling experiences. The immersive sound lets you lose yourself in your favorite music, where the sound is de delivered with acoustic accuracy anywhere in the room. This absorption technique has been used in other fields, but this joint initiative with Smart Materials and Acoustic Meta Materials Group marks its first application in a loudspeaker. Now, coming to the specifications of KEF LS50 Wireless 2. Its dimensions are 30.5 cm in height, 20 cm in width and 31.1 cm in depth. It weighs 20 0.1 kilograms. Its frequency response is 45 hertz to 28 kilohertz. Its design is very similar to the LS50 speakers. The UniQ driver array, the beautiful carbon black, titanium gray, mineral white and crimson red and curved front panel, all of them combine to create the product that is eye-catching. It has built-in Chromecast, Bluetooth and AirPlay connectivity. You can also connect these speakers through an Ethernet cable. It is also accessible from the KEF Connect app. It has an HDMI socket to get connected to the TV, an AUX inputs and a subwoofer output. 